Daisy and, and we're, we're twins. twins. Guess what's coming up soon guys? What's that? If you guessed Mother's Day, then you are correct. Hooray! Good job! <laughs> we will be making something real special today. Do you guys want to see? Yeah? Here, let me show you. So Cute. this is what we made beforehand. It's the finished product. We drew some of mom's favorite things, chickens, flower. We said what we like about mom and the flower. And shout out to mom, by the way. She's our camera woman. We love you, mom. Thanks for everything. Hi, everyone. Awesome. So Let's how go. about we get started, guys? Let's go. Here's what you'll need, guys. A ruler. Now you don't need one as long. A 10 centimeter ruler will do just fine. A pen, a scissors, glue stick, markers, and three muffin cups. You'll also need two pieces of paper. We just use scrap paper, just to be more environmentally friendly. Oh, also there's a, <laughs> I, you'll see I have a cereal box here. So what we're gonna do is cut one side, the big side of the cereal box out. We're gonna use it as a template, as you can see here. Yeah, but you can use any other cardboard box you have. It doesn't have to be a cereal box. Right, so first thing you're going to do is draw an eight centimeter line and connect the two, e connect the two ends together with a semicircle like this. And there's your pot. So we're going to decorate it now. So it's really up to you guys what you want to write or draw. Um, you can see from our example that we wrote the words and then we put mom's favorite things, so like a chicken, cute. But you can just write a note, you can put a photo of your mom. You can simply even write out in words what she really likes. You can make it your own and be creative, honestly. Yeah. So I'm keeping it simple, I'm just gonna write Happy Mother's Day and then we can move on. Once you have finished decorating the pot, we will move on to drawing the stems of the towers. Right, so we're going to need three stems. The stem is going to be four centimeters long and then about half a centimeter wide. You can just keep drawing the lines like so. So another stem here, and another stem here, and then simply connect, draw the other side of the stem, and then repeat. And then once those are done, you can just uh, close it up with a ruler. It doesn't have to be perfect, that's fine. How's your vase coming along? I'm sure it's looking pretty. So green for green stems, obviously. What's next? And we will draw out the leaves. Draw out. It's really optional. If you don't want to include leaves, you don't have to. Let's draw out the leaves. Leaf one. And leaf two. the shapes out of the paper. What you're going to do is color the center yellow. That'll be kind of like the center. And then you can write a nice word inside, something you like about your mom or something nice about mom. So I'm gonna write smart. Right, and then repeat for the other two muffin cups. A cereal box, we're just using it. We cut off one side to use as like a template. Yeah. So you can use any cardboard that works for you. Yeah, so let's get pasting on. We have a blank paper, another scrap paper, for our basis, mm -hmm. so we don't make a mess. So what we're gonna do, just so we can glue things on, is glue things on, because if we get glue on the table, then... and stick on your canvas, at the bottom of your canvas, like so. Beautiful. Perfect. And then, we do the same on. Stem. Stems. Okay, so and same. the same for the petals. And then let's put some leaves on. Oh, this is the finished product. How did yours turn out? I'm sure it turned out great. 
Awesome! I hope daisies are your favorite flowers. <laughs> so you can give this to mom. I'm sure it'll brighten up her day and you can just remind her how much you love her and how much she matters to you. Happy Mother's Day! Yeah. And stay safe. See you guys Enjoy. next time. Until next time.